Hey guys, welcome to today's video. Guys, in today's video, I wanna share with you a gourmand layering combination that I've been doing that has had me in a choke hold, okay? I could not wait to come on here and share it with you guys because I'm gonna share with you five fragrances that pair beautifully with this layering combination. And when I tell y'all, when I say to you, when I express my emotions to you that you're gonna get your life and smell so amazing this fall, Please believe me. Y'all, I'm just really excited. If you want to know about the combination, just keep watching. Guys, before we get started with the video, please make sure you're subscribed to the channel. Make sure that red button turns gray. Tap that notification bell so you don't miss any of my uploads. Thumbs up the video so I know you love my content. And finally, leave me a comment below so we can get to know each other. Now, let's get started with the video. All right, guys. So in this video, we have products that are high-end and we have products that are low end, okay? Now, let's start with the shower routine, one of my favorite parts of self-care. You guys know I love a good fragrance, I love spraying my fragrances, heavy at that, <laughs> but I love my shower routines. So, coming off of doing watermelons and pineapples and coconuts and strawberry routines, when I did this routine, it was like a big breath of fresh air because it's like, okay, okay, fall, you're here. You know, well, you're not here yet, but you're coming. And I can appreciate you and I'm embracing you because these scents are just like having me in a chokehold. So let's start with the bar soap. You guys know I'm always stressing the bar soap, the regular Dove bar soap to you guys for my base clean because I need you to know, like, although I love these body washes, for me, I just need something that I feel like is gonna get me cleaner. You know what I mean? I love the Fufu La La's, I love the scents, I love all that. And I'm not saying they don't really, they can't get you clean, but for me, I just need that extra added security of the bar soap, okay? So this is what I'm using, and this is shea butter and vanilla. It's real regular, it is what it is, okay? So after I've done my base clean and I've gotten that out the way, now it's time to have fun. So the first body wash. <sighs> it's the Coconut and Coffee by OGX. Y'all know I'm so super excited about this. I'm obsessed with this. I cannot get enough of this. It smells incredible. I love the coffee. I love the coconut. It's one of the best fall body washes in my collection. One of the best body washes in my collection, period. I'm just obsessed, okay guys? Like it smells so good. And I'm not a coffee drinker. I'm not like a coffee fiend. I'm not that girl. But in the body wash, in fragrances, I love the scent of coffee and not too much because I don't wanna smell like a coffee shop. That's not giving anything, okay? I don't wanna give a coffee shop. But with the sweetness of the coconut, a little bit of the coffee, it is everything, okay? When you get this wet in your shower, you are going to just be singing, like singing in the shower, just having a good old time, enjoying your self-care because it smells amazing, okay? So we've done our base clean with the Dove and we used our coconut and coffee body wash. Now it's time to scrub and exfoliate. So we're going to use the Velvet Coffee by tree hut we might as well just keep it all coffee right i told you guys that this smells like a hazelnut coffee <sighs> i'm literally getting high off of these scents y'all it smells so good okay it does not get any better when it comes to a coffee scent like a coffee scented product body care product to me than this this smells so good oh, it smells so good and it's just like straight up coffee there's no coconut and coffee like in the body wash or you know it's just a coffee scent but it smells like hazelnut i'm obsessed okay thank you tree hut this and this i'm gonna tell y'all the smiles in the shower when i'm using this it's just like self-care makes me happy okay this is amazing so now we're out the shower we've pat dry and now we need our oil so we're gonna go in with the kiehl's creme de corpse nourishing body oil it's not like super cheap but it's not super super pricey 
it's like right there in the middle. Kiehl's is a great product. I love, love Kiehl's products. And also the Creme de Corpse Body Cream. This could pair well with um, this routine as well. But I got something else for the routine. But if you wanted to just pair it with this and, you know, do the matching cream, you could. I've done that and it was really nice. But this one right here that I'm about to show you after this, this one gave it two thumbs up, okay? So like I said, we need our oil. So this is going to lock our moisture in. This smells like honey. It's a beautiful scent. It's not too strong in scent, but it moisturizes beautifully. I love that the sprayer, it doesn't get stuck. It doesn't squirt out too harsh. It's the perfect atomizer and the perfect dry oil for your skin. So the Kiehl's Creme de Corpse Nourishing Dry Body Oil. All right, so now we're all greased up. We're looking like Keisha from belly now it's time to moisturize with a body cream so i'm going to use the boom boom the boom boom the boom 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 bye bye no <laughs> we're going to use the boom boom cream i used to call it bum bum so sol de janeiro like they just got so sick and tired of people calling it bum bum because it's spelled b-u-m so you know bum <laughs> bum but it's boom boom okay so y'all this cream is everything y'all already know most people are familiar with this scent if you're not get familiar with it okay because it smells incredible oh oh my goodness this has pistachios this has almonds this has caramel y'all it's so decadent it smells so good and going with the coffee routine it just adds that it just adds that sweetness that it needs to the coffee and the honey and the pistachio and the caramel. When I tell you, you're going to smell like a snack, okay? You're going to be the snack, if you know what I mean. You will be the snack, okay? Wink, wink. <laughs> All right. So now we've moisturized with our body cream. So now we're gonna go in with a body spray. I've been telling you guys that I've been layering and adding body mist, fragrance mist, to my layering self-care routines and I've been loving it, okay? I wasn't doing it before, but I started to do it because, you know, Instagram's algorithm, they know what I'm into. They always showing me, you know, body care and self-care um, reels and things like that. So I saw a lot of the girls, like a lot of the self-care girls using body mist in their self-care routines, in their layering shower routines. So I was like, you know what? I have a couple of body sprays. Let me go on ahead and try it too. And I'm hooked. Like, I can't, like, not use a body spray in conjunction with my fragrances. Y'all, it's a whole thing. It's a whole hot mess now. So, So Cheriosa, um, Brazilian Crush 62, the salted caramel scent. Y'all, it smells so good. So, with the routine, like, are you seeing where we're going with this? Are you seeing the coffee and the coconut and the coffee scrub with the, um the the body cream and this y'all it's a vibe it's a moment no one is going to be smelling better than you you're going to be devoured okay come on now <laughs> you're going to get devoured okay because that's how good you're going to be smelling so spray this all over your body all over your body from head to toe now the fragrances that layer beautifully with this routine because you can already smell you can you already smell you with the coffee and the coconut and the caramel and the pistachio and the salt can you smell the snack that's radiating off of your skin can you smell it okay imagine with me so now we're going to go on to the first fragrance which is more on the pricier side actually i'm not going to say pricier it is it's expensive it's expensive it's 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 pricey okay not pricey or it's just pricey period and it's bond number nine new york nights y'all <sighs> this fragrance right here love at first sniff Lo lo love at first sniff this is a safe blind buy if you love gourmand scents period i am obsessed okay when i tell you i have like my bond collection guys like it's like covered like i just love it so much because every single one of my bond fragrances gets this type of reaction from me and when you have a collection of about 11 bond fragrances and they all get that reaction from you 
you know that collection is sick, okay? I love my Bond collection, guys. And this one right here is my gourmand treat, my gourmand delight. I'm obsessed, okay? It opens up with gardenia, there's carnation, there's jasmine, there's sea notes, there's patchouli, there's sandalwood, coffee, and caramel. Y'all, if you love gourmand, but you don't wanna smell too foody, you know what I mean? You don't wanna smell too literal, you need this, okay? You need this. The coffee and the caramel in the dry down just sends me to another place. I cannot stop smelling myself. Like when I'm wearing this, I cannot stop smelling myself. This is a sexy date night fragrance. This is a fall, whenever you wanna just smell like that girl, whenever you wanna smell like everything, you will reach for New York Nights by Bond number nine. I personally don't have any performance issues with this fragrance. I've heard different from other people. Fragrances are subjective. You know, they perform differently on everybody due to body chemistry, due to your diet, your water intake, so many different factors. If you purchase a fragrance on a discounted website and you have no cap, so the majority of the fragrance done evaporated out. So, you know, you're not gonna have anything any fragrance oils to latch onto your skin. I mean, a host of so many reasons why a fragrance would not perform the same on you than it does on someone else. On me, I have no issues with this fragrance. I overspray though and get my life because it's just so good. It's so decadent. It just smells amazing that I just wanna keep spraying it and keep smelling it. Bond number nine, New York Nights. Next up by YSL, we have Black Opium. I know she's not super popular and she's not super loved in the frag world, but she's loved by me. I love her. She will always be in my collection. This is my third bottle. <laughs> third, one, two, three. My third bottle. I absolutely love this fragrance. It has jasmine, it has coffee. It's a beautiful scent. It's sweet. It's so super sweet, but the coffee dry down is everything on my skin. I'm obsessed. This goes beautifully with that routine. If you like gourmand, if you like coffee, you will love this. And paired with that routine, y'all, it is everything okay this has no performance issues um i don't wear it too much outside of the house but definitely in the house definitely to bed and only because i used to wear this like this was my like my world <laughs> she was my everything i told you this is my third bottle but you know there was a time in my life that i used to wear this fragrance all the time like date night date day like whatever but as i've grown and my collection has grown and you know sometimes you wear a fragrance so much that you wanna smell something else, you know what I mean? Like you don't not like the fragrance or not love the fragrance, but you just wanna smell other things. So that's the reason why I don't really wear her outside of the house, but I definitely love wearing her to bed and inside the house. Black Opium by YSL. Next up, we have Lalique Soleil. Guys, this is a fruity, floral, gourmand type fragrance that doesn't smell too literal, again, because I'm not a gourmand person that loves to smell like too fruity, but I definitely want like the essence of that, but not too much, if you know what I mean. This is a beautiful scent. It has coffee, it has caramel, it has pear. I feel like it can be worn all year round, although it's a gourmand type scent, like it has all the notes, like it has the coffee, the praline, the sandalwood, um, the candied almonds, the caramel, but it still has a freshness to it that I feel like can take it throughout the entire year. This is an all year round type of scent for someone. If you like a signature scent, this can be a signature scent for you. You can save 20% on soavanguard.com using my discount code, the great 20 and get this fragrance. It's so beautiful. The bottle is beautiful. It looks beautiful on a vanity. It smells beautiful. I don't have any performance issues with this fragrance. And with this routine, get your life. The next fragrance on the list is one of my favorite designer fragrances ever. I love this. It will always be in my collection. It's a for life fragrance for me. And it's Dolce & Gabbana, the only one. Y'all, it has coffee. It has caramel. There's also orange. There's um, bergamot. There's orange blossom. There's rose. This is a beautiful scent. It's one of the most addictive fragrances that I have in my collection. Like once I smell it, I just want to either keep smelling it or I just want to wear it. It's so simple, but it smells so good to me. It's nothing that I would reach for on a super sexy date night. You know what I mean? Like I have so many other fragrances that I would rather reach for, like 
New York Nights or, you know what I mean? The next fragrance that we're gonna talk about. But this is a beautiful fragrance to wear in the day. It's a beautiful fragrance to wear to bed. Like if you're the type of person that loves to smell sweet in the house, I love smelling sweet in the house. Anything woody and like burning and earthy and tobacco and smoky, I don't wanna smell that when I'm going to bed. I don't wanna smell that in the house whatsoever. I wanna smell those fragrances when I'm dressed up when I'm wearing like a leather jacket, some boots. I like smelling scents like that when I'm in that mode. In the house, I just wanna smell sweet, period. Like that's just what it is for me. I wanna smell sweet and this is a perfect fragrance to wear in the house. Perfect for fall, perfect for turtlenecks and sweaters. It lasts on your skin, it's so addictive and I am obsessed. Dolce & Gabbana, the only one. Okay, so the last fragrance that pairs so beautifully with this routine is Delox by Tiziana Terenzi. Y'all, y'all already know how I feel about this fragrance. This is honey, this is rose, this is coffee, this is vanilla, this is my obsession, okay? Like, I love this fragrance so much. Now, if you have Intense Cafe by Montal, it'll pair beautifully with this routine as well. Any of your coffee fragrances, anything with caramel, anything gourmand will pair beautifully with this routine. So I think I told you all the notes, right? So there's iris, there's coffee, there's rose, there's myrrh, there's amber, there's musk, there's honey. Listen, it's a beautiful, beautiful scent. I think it's a safe blind buy. Um, if you love fragrances like Gentle Fluidity Gold by MFK, I feel like you'll love this. But this is more sweet, more... The juice doesn't smell light and airy, if that makes any sense. It smells thick and it smells syrupy and sweet. It smells like dripping honey, you know what I mean? With like vanilla surrounding it with rose. Y'all, this is so freaking beautiful. I'm obsessed, okay? Like seriously obsessed. This fragrance can be worn all year round. Again, if you choose to, um, I feel like it can be an all year round type scent. But for me, I love pulling it out in the fall because of the coffee and the rose and the honey. It just feels like a fall cozy type fragrance to me. And I love it. You can save 20% off this fragrance on soavantgarde.com using my discount code, thegreat20, and get you some Deluxe, okay? All right, guys, we've come to the end of the video. Leave it in the comments below and let me know what are some of your sweet gourmand coffee fragrances that you would pair with this routine. Cause the routine is routining, okay? Like if I do say so myself, it is everything. When I tell y'all, you're gonna do this routine and you're literally gonna be like wanting to smell yourself the whole entire time because that's how decadent and amazing you're going to smell. So let's talk about it below like we always do. Remember to stay safe. Be great, stay great, and always strive for greatness. AI the Great, signing out, but I'll see you in my next video. Peace.